In this slide, we see some tissue. I can tell you it's a liver, and after we zoom in, then you'll know it's a liver for sure. But notice that in this liver, it's not quite as pink as it usually is. Well, is that because the technician forgot to put in enough uh, eosin into the stainer? Or is it because a large portion of the cells are vacuolated? Well, I think uh, B is the correct answer because look, here are hepatocytes and notice that within the cytoplasm of the hepatocytes there are these small cleared uh, spaces which represent fat. This is a fatty liver. Very often liver, uh, fatty livers are divided into microvesicular versus macrovesicular. A microvesicular uh, uh, liver is one in which the fatty spaces are within the hepatocytes, basically all these small little fuzzy areas here. And they are small, so they're called microvesicular. In a macrovesicular, the fat spaces are big enough to be actually larger than liver cells, and they may, may be quite huge. And I think we could say, although this is predominantly a microvesicular fatty liver, there are some big fatty globules out here which are much bigger than cells, and they're not completely within cells. Oh, here's some more out here as well. Uh, main overwhelming commonest causes for fatty liver statistically, uh, diabetes, uh, obesity itself, as well as alcohol. Uh, there are uh, a variety of other toxic compounds besides alcohol which cause fat in the liver, but alcohol is without a doubt the most common. See these little fuzzy things within the patty sites? Those are microvesicles. You see these larger things out here which are bigger than cells? That's uh, macrovesicles. Also notice that this liver, even though it's loaded with fat, maybe half of its weight is fat, if you can estimate that from the cross-sectional area, it still has a preserved architecture. It's not cirrhosis. There's no increased fat. And if you go and try to find portal areas every now and then, you will generally see that they are arranged in a relatively uh, hexagonal um, array, which means the architecture is preserved. This is fatty change, also called fatty morphosis, also called microvesicular versus uh, macrovesicular fat, also called fatty liver. Thank you.